Hello, in this video we show you how to manage Bluetooth connections on the Samsung Galaxy Note 3. So the first thing you need to do is actually switch Bluetooth on or off, uh, depending on what you're trying to achieve. And there are two primary ways to do this, the first of which is to drag the notification bar down and see if you've got a shortcut in the bar at the top here. Now you can see we've got Bluetooth just here, but if you didn't you click this icon and you should find Bluetooth within this menu. To switch it on, tap the icon like so and Bluetooth will be switched on and you'll get this screen pop up if you haven't previously connected to other Bluetooth devices that are in range. Now we're going to avoid that just for the moment because we're going to drag down from the top we're going to click settings and under connections we're going to see Bluetooth. You can see we've got the green icon here which means it's switched on. If we slide it to the left that will then switch off. We can then tap into here and this is where we can manage Bluetooth in a bit more detail. So let's switch Bluetooth on. So it's turning Bluetooth on and it's now scanning uh, for other devices as it was if we switch Bluetooth on from the shortcut bar. Now at the moment, we haven't got our device visible to others and the Note 3 cannot detect any other Bluetooth devices in range. So what we're going to do is we're going to uh, make another device visible. So if I scan again, we'll now see that we've got a G2 visible to it. Now to connect to that device, you will tap on that connection and it will ask to pair. Now you get a pass key and on the G2 that I've got out of shot, I've now been asked to pair where I can cancel or pair. So let's cancel that for now and the two devices will not be able to connect. Let's do it again and this time we shall pair the two. So now we've paired the two, we actually get a little cog icon with some of the settings and depending on what you're connecting to will depend on what actions you have. So the best we've got here is to use the G2 for internet access but you can see here that I can rename it if I choose to something that's more suitable for me to remember or I can unpair it and that forgets the G2 although it still sees it I have to put in the pass key again to actually be able to connect to it. I can then make my device visible or not to other devices by switching this on here. Now for security reasons it's best to keep your device uh, sort of hidden unless you really need to. So for example now with that device visible I can now search on the G2 uh, for that specific device and it would come up in my list of devices that I could connect to. So if I do that and I connect to it you see that my G2 is now trying to pair with the Note 3. If I click cancel, I can turn Bluetooth off and that's how you manage Bluetooth on the Samsung Galaxy Note 3.